Alrighty, welcome back everybody to episode 43 in our F1 Manager 96 playthrough. Got the Spanish Grand Prix up today after a pretty dismal Monaco. Uh, qualified pretty poorly and finished the race mid-pack. So about what I expected. Monaco is a bit of a tough one for me. So let's just get into it. So Benetton have pulled away quite a bit on us now, 10 points. They had a real good Monaco. But we did get both cars home, which is the main thing. So we got five days to go. We are going to go with a two-stop around Spain. I think that will work out okay. And of course we do have our back to our normal setup, right? Yep. Everything's looking good. All right. So I guess we just head off to Barcelona and uh, hope for a better race. Should be much more better than uh, Monaco was. At least I hope it is. I mean, it can't be can't be much worse, right? So we'll just do this and then we'll uh, mute the mic and do our track guide and um, see how we go. So I think it's 65 lap race, right? Typically, I think it's a 65 lap race. Yeah. All right. So back to our usual setup here. And uh, it's been pretty good for us. So, of course, if you remember last year this race was cruelly snatched away from us uh, where Panis was comfortably leading and uh, had a mechanical problem right with uh, in the last stint I think he might have got to like 10 laps to go or something and then he had mechanical problem. So let me just mute the mic and we will do the track guide. So there we go, that's uh, Barcelona. Of course, the last sector is a little different to what we have today. With the little chicane there before the last corner now. But other than that, I think it's pretty similar.
So we've got to figure out our tire strategy here. So hopefully we can be a little bit more competitive. So we'll go out about here. Send out Ollie. Hopefully we get a bit better luck than what we did last year too. Um, with Olivier looking like he was going to crush it and it all went pear shaped. So we used 15 there. We'll stick with that tire. And uh, we'll lower this down a bit, I think. We'll go 15 and 13 with him and then 15 and 14 on that. We'll see if that changes anything. We'll just speed through the time a little bit more. There we go, good enough. Send out Yoss. All right, so hopefully, we can be a bit more competitive. So far it's not looking great, is it? Yeah, real slow. I guess we are not pushing yet either, so there is that. All right, so end of the session. And we are 15th and 16th. A good second and a half off. All right. But we do have quality coming up. And I think we will do our typical that on the suspension and we'll see if we can do anything there. Did I change the tire over? I think I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Okay. Alright, let's see if we can actually do something. So I'm going to go straight out here. same time still just them and still just them so we should get a clear lap in oh that was a terrible lap hmm We appear to be struggling, don't we? For some reason. We really are.
So we'll see if Yoss can chase. Yoss is at least P7. Johnny Herbert's done a real good lap. Oh, there you go. Panis breaks into the 1 minute 20s. But Yoss cannot do anything. So maybe he prefers more downforce. I mean, we can give him that. So I'm going to also go on both of theirs, I think. And we're also going to put our race engine in now. So I guess Yoss is going to go out first here. So we'll just speed time through a little bit and uh, we'll go out with like 10 minutes to go. And hopefully, David Coulthard's on pole. Interesting. All right, so Yoss is gonna go out first now. And now Ollie is. On our last set of soft compound tires. We tweaked the downforce and that's all we did, so... Yep, Yoss is struggling. Oh well. Alright, so, uh... Good to know, I guess. So with Yoss, I'm going to go back down to 16 and 15. And I think with Ollie, I'm going to go 14 and 15, because that's what he did. He actually liked that one, so we'll do that. And uh, yeah, that's all we're going to do. So I forgot my fuel already. Um, I'm just going to assume 15. So that is going to be 12 laps. That's going to be 24. So that should be enough. So where are we? Fifth and tenth. Alright, well, uh, we shall see. Alright, so he needs to be starting on tyre number two. Tyre number three, sorry. Alright, so Verstappen is on that. So does that make sense? Yes, it does. All right, so you know what? I'm gonna lower the fuel down a little. And uh, we should be okay on that, I think. If 
I need to put more in, I will, but I think we'll be okay. All right, let's uh, see what we can do. Hopefully, we get some good luck. But who knows, right? Oh, Villeneuve's done. Schumacher is done. Ooh. Lemieux. So this could be a day where we need to get things done, huh? All right, so Ollie is getting ready to come in. So we're going to be perfectly fine on fuel. Yoss. Ten point five. Cool fires out. Oh, Rubens is leading currently. I think he's doing one stop. They are. Gonna be a Williams 1 2 by the looks of it. Frenson just stopped. Alright, so we're coming up to our stop again. Is Frenson actually going to win this? Alright, in comes Ollie for his final stop. I guess we did uh, fluff the strategy, eh? Looks like we could have done a one stop. All right. Inoue is out. Hannes is trying real hard to close the gap down to Damon, but I don't think he's going to do it. So it looks like we'll be fourth. So 
So Rubens Barrichello picks up his first ever win. Yeah, fourth and seventh. That's not too bad, not too bad. I think we screwed up by trying to go two stops, but uh, hey, it is what it is. More points at least. So we should close a little bit down on Benetton, and we do. By a point because McLaren overhaul us. Of course. Alright, well, uh, not much we can do about that. So I think the automatic gearbox will work. So I'm gonna keep that here for now. I need to repair those two as well, don't I? I think the automatic gearbox is a good idea. So we'll keep what we have. And uh, it's already repaired. All right. So I think that is probably going to be it for this episode. Uh, and we will be back. for the next race, which I believe is the French Grand Prix. I think it's the French Grand Prix. It's either France or Canada. So our parts are all repaired. And we've had back-to-back -to -back races where we've got both cards home. So Montreal is up next. All right. So that is it. And that will be a one-stopper. So we'll just get all that prepared so we don't have to worry about it. All right. So everything's looking pretty good, I think. So... Our first points finish in a couple races. No, we didn't do anything at Europe and we didn't do anything at, at Monaco. But, uh, yeah. We're battling McLaren for fourth. I don't think we'll be able to catch Benetton. They look pretty good with that lineup of Villeneuve and Alesi. So maybe the Peugeot power was the wrong decision. All right, so we just got these two, so we need, ah, uh, cancel, cancel. Ah, oh, whatever, it's fine. I think I screwed that up though, didn't I? I oh, know one of you one of you all right so that is going to be it I fancy so actually we'll just keep doing this that's fine so the hat is next you have the little keychain the model car that thing and that thing. Alright, so we need you as well. Alright, so we are constructing these. Alright, so merchandise is looking okay still. And uh, what are we? Should have about 180? 180 mil still. So not bad. Alright, that's going to be it for this episode. So we'll be back with episode 44 and the French Grand Prix. So thank you very much for watching everybody and catch you later.